net present value. Net present value is the difference between the present value of cash inflows and the present value of cash outflows over a period of time. NPV is used in capital budgeting and investment planning to analyze the profitability of a projected investment or project. NPV is the result of calculations that find the current value of a future stream of payments, using the proper discount rate. Let's see the net present value formula. If there's one cash flow from a project that will be paid one year from now, then the calculation for the NPV of the project is as follows. NPV equals cash flow, divided by, 1 plus I, to the power T, minus, initial investment. Where, I equals required return or discount rate. T equals number of time periods. Here we are just discounting cash flows to the present period. Then subtracting the initial investment to find out if we are able to make any profit or not. Now let's see an example. Let's say we have a project. To set up this project we invested $10,000. Now we will run this project or the expected life of this project is 5 years. The cash we get in the first year is $2,500, second year is $4,000, third year is $5,000, fourth year is $3,000 and the last year is $1,000. And the interest rate is 6%. Now if you have to calculate the on-PV from here, we need to discount these cash flows to the present period. To do this we can use the formula of present value, which is cash flow divided by 1 plus R to the power T. We will take 2500 and divide that by 1 plus 0 0.6 to power 1. We used power 1 as we are discounting the value of year 1. We will do the same for other periods too, and we will get the present value of each period. If we add them we will get $13,239. Now we need to subtract the initial investment, which was $10,000. That will give us $3,239. Now the decision making. If we get a positive NPV here, that means the business added value to our invested money. And it could be profitable. And if it's negative then we should avoid the project. And if we have two depending projects, then we should invest in the project that has a higher NPV as we can't invest in both.